Hello everyone, and welcome back. So today I wanted to talk about the giant African millipede, also known as Archispiro streptus. Um, I actually got these from a friend. He had four available, and I'm like, uh, hell yeah, I'm going to get some of these. Um, these babies usually get about 15 inches long, and their main diet consists of, oh, and then we got Speedy Gonzales over here. Their diet ma mainly consists of, like, um, basically, like, dying out vegetation. Um, they like, um, apples, bananas, lettuce. Um, I'm keeping them right now in an enclosure, such as this. It's a little small for them, but since they're pretty tiny and they don't really like to roam about too much, this is actually perfect for them from now. I do have some substrate in here, and as well as some lettuce. I have a little, uh, cap over there filled with water. Um, I will be upgrading them to a bigger... Uh, enclosure soon. However, I'm just gonna wait for them to get a little bigger and they are going crazy today very camera shy apparently and Their life expectancy is about five to seven years old So they can live quite a while if you take really good care of them. One thing that people uh, like to question about is um, is sometimes they observe their millipedes with um like these mites on them. And don't be alarmed, those mites are actually healthy for them if uh, found in small amounts. If there's a lot, that might be a problem, but if you see some mites on them, don't worry, they actually, um, it's it's a mutualistic relationship. They actually, um, they're used to like clean each other and so the mites get to eat and the millipedes basically get to stay clean. So I'm just gonna put him back over here. Jesus, he's going crazy. And so is that one. <laughs> oh my gosh, but they are great pets. Very easy to care for. And they're just such fun to look at. And they're great for uh, classrooms. Um, it's just, they're an amazing, amazing creatures. That's, that's all I can say about them. Um, I cannot tell if they are male or female yet. I'll have to do some more research on that. And I'll have to uh, basically look at them. I'm pretty sure you can see the gonads on the other sides. But I don't know if they're developed yet or not. But I will definitely look that up. But as you can see, they're quite, they're very odd. <laughs> it's not like a centipede. They're very, very friendly. Their only main uh, weapon of defense is curling up, or they can use a, um, a liquid that they can protrude out from their, um, from the ends here, and they will squirt it out, and it basically, if it gets into your eyes or something like that, it's pretty, it's not that fun. So make sure that you uh, don't get any of that liquid, um, any in any cuts or in your eyes or especially in your mouth as well. So anyways, they are amazing, amazing creatures. They're so interesting to look at and I love their red, their little red legs. So cute. See that one there? Crawling, well, that one's falling right behind. Really cool. Anyways, guys, that's, uh, these are um, amazing. Uh, the giant African millipede Absolutely incredible. Definitely a great uh, creature to own. Very easy to uh, manage and just so interesting to look at and, and raise. I'm hoping to uh, breed these um, in the distant future. We'll see how that goes. Anyways, thank you very much guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any 